good morning student it's good to be back once again all right students so we'll start with a new block that is block 25 so domains of the earth one will start from block 25 so our topic of discussion for today is features of the four domains resources require our diagram of the earth if you have so please uh, you have to get ready with diagram of the earth and your s1 that is your worksheet one your notebook and your exit content book and the keywords for today is domains lithosphere hydrosphere atmosphere and biosphere so our aim for today is you will be able to explain the features of the four domains of the earth so before we get into our further discussion uh, let's be clear with the key terms so first of all what is domains domain is a domain all right this is domain okay so a domain refer to a particular location and what is lithosphere the lithosphere is the rocky outer part of the earth it is made up of brittle crust and the top part of the upper metal so lithosphere uh, it, it is okay it contains the rocky outer part of the earth okay so what is hydrosphere all right before we start into what is hydrosphere hydrosphere is actually referring to water okay so all the waters on the earth's surface such as lakes seas and sometimes including water over the earth's surface as clouds so those are hydrosphere and what is atmosphere and biosphere all right atmosphere the atmosphere is the thick layer of the gases surrounding the earth so those are known as atmosphere and what is biosphere biosphere means biosphere is the domain of the earth in which life exists all right in which life exists we'll be discussing more about what is biosphere atmosphere and all right hydrosphere lithosphere in our upcoming uh, discussions so let's get into it i hope now you are clear with the meaning of the term all right so now uh, here is a question for you imagine that there was no land on the earth where will you live and how so the question here is imagine that there is there was no land on the earth where will you live and how all right student we all know if there is no land on earth life will be very different all right, all right life will be very different okay maybe we will all be marine animals we'll be marine animals like we'll be animal who live on the uh, water or ocean seas with gills to breathe and fin to swim will be like a fish all right and life on earth as we know is possible because of the combination of land water and air all right so why we are living on land is because we can we breathe air we also can we also consume water right so it is the existence of land water and air life is possible on earth so class today we will learn about the four regions of domains of the earth okay we will we will learn about the four regions or domains of the earth that is we will begin with three domains uh, basically lithosphere hydrosphere and atmosphere all right all right so this is you have to observe the picture carefully okay you have to observe the picture carefully because all the domains are mentioned here in this picture okay first of all when we talk about uh, hydrosphere as you can see the color of water indicated in blue so these are hydrosphere as you can see the marine animals octopus fish and some of the plants that live on the water and you can also see lithosphere that is the earth comprises of animals we also live under lithosphere okay that is we live on the land dry land and then you will see the trees the bird as well as when you talk about the atmosphere so this is the atmosphere okay that is the gaseous particle that is above the lithosphere so it is a thick layer of gases where life exists suppose you see a uh, okay you see also a cloud a bird you see a bird you see a cloud right so uh, all this combination of lithosphere hydrosphere and atmosphere under which life exists is known as biosphere okay so biosphere is a combination of both 
lithosphere, atmosphere, hydrosphere under which life exists. Okay, so this area they are indicated as biosphere. I hope now you are clear with it. So let's get into our further discussion. All right. So here are the features of the four domain. Okay, here are the features of the four domain. So point number one. Uh, the four domains of the earth that is point number one lithosphere the lithosphere is the solid portion of the earth okay so lithosphere is the solid portion of the earth and what is atmosphere as we have also learned the gases layer that surround the earth and what is hydrosphere water covers a very big area of the earth surface and this area is called the hydrosphere remember 71 percent of the earth is covered with water okay Remember, 71% of earth is covered with water. So you have to keep that in mind. Uh, similarly, what is biosphere? It is the narrow zone, as we have seen, uh, where land, water, and air together are found. Alright, so this is talking about this layer, okay? So it is the narrow zone where land, water, and air all together are found, okay? So this, those are known as biosphere okay student so here is a question for you why is the biosphere limited to only a narrow zone so the question here is why is the biosphere limited to only a narrow zone okay when i say narrow zone it is talking about only this portion okay why it is limited only to a narrow zone so this is a question for you to uh, right, answer okay so i won't be giving the answer for this I want you guys to think carefully, okay? Alright, so now things to do. That is, uh, your you have to complete your practice question 1, 2, and 3. For that, you will find in page number 39 under the content book. And you have to complete your worksheet S1. That you will find in page number 21 under the uh, worksheet. Uh, under the worksheet. So that's it, uh, students. Take, thank you. Take care and stay safe.